Um, Doug, first of all, you did a fantastic job. This was his first PowerPoint that he delivered to our group. And he mentioned during our contact earlier in the week that obviously he's a very experienced businessman who travels and gives a lot of speeches for his company. And it's different because when we have it, when we're doing a business presentation with PowerPoint, it's, it's a different atmosphere, it's a different feeling, right? And he was a little nervous about it, thinking, I hope I keep everybody engaged, I hope it works well, technical difficulties. They didn't go past Lisa's speech, so I'm not sure what happened there. All in all, you did a terrific job with the PowerPoint. I think one of the things you got kind of stuck over here, kind of what Lisa did, what, what someone else pointed out earlier, and I think we all do that. When we have a screen filled with pictures, we all think that we can't still engage and walk out here a little bit, but we can. It's a big screen, and that gives you more purposeful movement to go back and forth. I think it's something we all need to practice, but don't let the screen stick you here and not move out of that. I thought your slides were great. It was great to see pictures of your girls. They've gotten so big since we first met you and, and started hearing about your family. I loved seeing the categories that you put yourself into. The one thing I was surprised we didn't see was golf, Doug. We didn't see, I mean, you've given great speeches on golf, and that's what I know most about you. And every time I walk through the living room and my husband's watching a tournament, I think, I wonder if Doug's watching this. And because you, you, we know you as golf guy, too. And so I was a little surprised at that. The one thing I think I would have loved to have heard more, just because we know you as a speaker and you've taught us so much over the years, is what changed from that first speech you did when you didn't think about it anymore and you said you, it was a train wreck, what, what did you learn between now and then? And what are some takeaway points that we could all benefit from your knowledge? Because you have taught us so much over the years. <clears throat> to use one of John's earlier quotes, you're so masterful at your word choice and your use and how you set up and write a speech. And because of that, I think you did a wonderful, wonderful job here. It was humorous, it was fun, it was engaging. The pictures were great. And overall, just a wonderful presentation. Thank you very much. Thank you.